A Johnson County community is rallying around a family whose son was killed in Afghanistan. 22-year-old Cale Miller died on Thursday from a roadside bomb. Zach Tecklenburg spoke with his family who said Miller had a hard time deciding what to do with his life until he found the Army. There's a lot of conflicting emotion for the family of Private First Class Cale Miller. Sadness, there's a lot of anger, um, despair, but also a great sense of pride. Miller was just over a month into his first deployment to Afghanistan. Driving a combat vehicle, Miller hit a roadside bomb on Thursday, flipping the vehicle, trapping him inside. Brother-in-law Frank Barden says Cale told the other men on the mission to save themselves. I think what he really liked was the camaraderie with his fellow squad mates. Which is apparent by his selfless final action. Now Barden is wondering how the family will go on without him. He was an incredible brother. Um, to my wife, an incredible son. Uh, he was an incredible uncle to my three year old. The family's asking for prayers. Not only for us, but for his squad mates who are over there, and they're going to continue on doing their duty um, even though they've lost one of their own. Zach Tecklenburg, 41 Action News. Miller served with a unit out of Washington State. The family has not announced funeral arrangements.